Most people might not realize how long ago Google actually implemented the taskbar that is now visible on so many larger screened Android devices. And this taskbar, since its implementation, has gone through quite a bit of iterative changes. And most recently, it has switched from a persistent or pinned taskbar at the bottom of the screen to something more transient, as we see on the Pixel Fold. Of course, other OEMs like Samsung have chose to leave it as the persistent or pinned version, but with the default Android behavior now being transient, something that you call up and it automatically dismisses itself, that will be kind of the way that everybody goes slowly, or at least everyone that just uses the default implementation. Now for me, that was a bit of a bummer because I would probably prefer to have the pinned version. I like the way it works on Samsung devices. I liked the way that it worked in prior versions of Google's implementation. I think it's okay on the Pixel Fold that you swipe up and then it goes away, but I would like to have the option to pin it down there at the bottom to just have it always accessible. Well, if you feel the same way as I do, I have some good news for you. This is an article, Android Police, written by Michal, who I have referenced as a tipster many times uh, via their Twitter account, but now they are writing for Android Police. Very, very cool to see. The headline reads, Android 14 may let you bring back the old taskbar on the Pixel tablet and the Pixel Fold. So what we have here is some stuff buried in the Android 14 Beta 3 that was released earlier this month. I think this article's yeah, back from June the 27th. It's actually a little bit of an old article, but I wanted to kind of bring it to you guys anyways. In that beta, Michelle discovered a new launcher flag labeled Enable Taskbar Pinning that when enabled lets the user switch between the new transient taskbar and the old persistent taskbar behavior. So here you can see an image of the transient bar, and here's an image of the persistent bar, which again, I think I would quite like to have. Now, of course, I did show you guys in a recent tips and tricks video that you can kind of get something similar if you switch from gesture navigation to the three button style, but I want to have gesture navigation and the taskbar. I want to have the best of both worlds. And hopefully this is an indicator that with Android 14 likely coming around the same time as the Pixel 8 launch, we may be getting exactly that on our larger screen Pixel devices like the Pixel Fold in the Pixel tablet. Now, Michelle does go on to say that this flag is not enabled by default at the moment. So if you're on that beta, it's not like this feature is there. It has to kind of be uh, dug into and enabled in order for that to be a thing that's actually functioning. Google hasn't turned it on yet, but it is buried in the code. It is definitely something that they're messing with, they're playing with, and they are testing. So hopefully that is an indicator of things to come. Even if you don't necessarily want this, you should still be waiting for this to happen simply because more options are always better than fewer options. At any rate, guys, pretty interesting stuff. Let me know what you think about this in the comments down below. Hit that subscribe button before you leave. I'll see you on the next one. And until next time, stay nerdy, my friends.